Hawaii is one of the most unique places on Earth. Its natural ecosystem is home to a large range of endemic and indigenous species, and its diverse environments range from tropical beaches like Avava Malu to the subalpine deserts that surround the sacred Mauna Kea. These special islands located at the center of the Pacific Ocean are already experiencing the effects of climate change. Each of Hawaii's people has an individual responsibility to prevent any additional impacts to Hawaii's climate. Climate Change in Hawaii, Heaha Ko Kuleana, is a mini documentary series that discusses climate change issues directly affecting Hawaii and provides simple and achievable solutions to those issues. The question is not whether climate change is happening in Hawaii, but rather, Heaha Ko Kuleana, what is your responsibility? Climate change is the result of carbon dioxide and other greenhouse gases being released into the atmosphere. Burning fossil fuels, deforestation, industrial processes, and some agricultural practices emit greenhouse gases that blanket the earth, trapping energy in the atmosphere and causing it to warm. Another issue contributing to climate change in Hawaii and many other cities is the heat island effect. One of the problems with the cities is that their surfaces actually can absorb more heat. And as you can, in fact, if you were to take a profile from uh, rural areas through the cities and you were to measure the temperatures along the way, you will see that rural areas are often colder, sometimes by several degrees lower than in the cities, because the cities, they tend to overheat themselves. To make matters worse, we are cutting the trees from the cities, making the situation a lot worse. The most achievable solution to the problem of climate change in Hawaii is to remove as much carbon dioxide from the atmosphere as each individual person puts in. One thing that we are exploring right now is the alternative, which is, you know what, have your life, enjoy the way you want it, but what we want to do is to generate an alternative mechanism for people to clean up the emissions that are generated by your consumption. Planting trees is a natural way to remove carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. However, the idea that every person plants enough trees to become carbon neutral can be hard to grasp, mostly because of the lack of time people have to care for trees. But new technology can help with that. So basically the idea is that there is a sensor that you put in the soil close to the plant, and this sensor is monitoring whether the plant is dry, whether the soil is dry or not. If it gets too dry, then the sensor turns a water pump that will add water to your plant. And this, this is take, using a reservoir of maybe five to seven gallons of water that will last for about one or two months. And pretty much you, all what you really need to care about is ensuring that that bucket of water has water. So that means that you need to take care of your plant maybe once or twice a month. All it would take to prevent any further damage from climate change in Hawaii would be for each person to become carbon neutral. Using Camilo Morrow's watering device, planting trees and caring for them can be simple. An environmental revolution can start here in Hawaii, and it can start with planting a tree.